846 last night, dispatch received a call of a subject with a knife at the Wiley Street apartment complex. Suspect was attacking victims. Officers were immediately dispatched. One of the residents of the apartments met him. He was in need of a place to stay. I believe her perception was, here's a helping hand I can give in return for the helping hand I've been given. Due to his behavior, he had been asked to leave. Kenny had done so. He returned last night to exact vengeance, not just on those that he had been with as they were not at the apartment, but at any target which was available. The tragedy was that a three-year-old little girl was having a birthday party just a few doors down from where Kenny had been staying. Kenny attacked, targeting the children initially three-year-old girl whose birthday it was was one of those seriously injured including two four-year-olds a six-year-old an eight-year-old and a 12-year-old along with three adults who tried to intercede to prevent the loss of lives of the children our victims are some of the newest members of our community they're victims from their past homes who have fled violence from Syria Iraq and Ethiopia our suspect is a man with an extensive criminal record spanning multiple states. Lives do remain in danger. Some of the victims will be forever scarred by the medical injuries that they received. They received life, life changing injuries. This was an attack against those who are most vulnerable, our children. It's untenable, unconscionable, and it's pure evil in my mind. But the response of our community, the response of the people, the faces that I've seen interacting on every level, the phone calls I've received today do renew my faith that we will be there today and tomorrow for these members who have suffered so much.